Hi guys, hello, hello everyone. Uh, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Uh, oh my god, it's been a long time since I last uploaded a video here on YouTube. I've missed you guys and uh, for all my new subscribers, thank you for subscribing to this channel and for all my old subscribers, um, thank you for sticking around. A lot has been going on lately and uh, I just had to, I needed some time and space and I, I really couldn't find the time to, you know, create content and upload uh, but I'm back um, today with another video new video and it's another haul video but this time it's a makeup haul from Nykaa I got a couple of stuff from Nykaa which I really want to show you guys uh, I think you're gonna love this one uh, I have some new amazing uh, products to show you and uh, this is actually the final look that I got from using all these products and all of these are very very inexpensive so if you're looking for something affordable very inexpensive and you are also trying out new makeup um, then stay tuned watch till the very end and uh, just see how I get this uh, makeup and this makeup look so yeah anyway without any more rambling let's get on to the video all right uh so let's get started i have a bunch of stuff to show you guys here but i will not go through each and every step uh, i'll only show you the new products that i'm trying out today um so let's start off i've already moisturized my face please ignore my big huge ass pimple on my forehead uh, i'm gonna go ahead and cover it up with the concealer but uh, I've already I went ahead and moisturized my face with this one. Uh, it's it's my favorite to use during summertime. The texture consistency is just so perfect. It's perfect for the summer heat. Let's move on to the next uh, step, which is the concealer. Um, so the concealer that I have today, I actually got a new one. But this is not a new concealer to try. This is. This is my, um, you know, my go-to ride or die concealer. It is the LA Girl Pro Conceal. I am not going to use a foundation. Nowadays, I just like to keep it very, very minimal and very natural. I just like to uh, cover my dark circles and uh, the spots that I get here and there. So uh, I like to take a little bit on the bridge of my nose here on the sides. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is I'll just let it sit on for like a couple of seconds uh, like 10-20 seconds especially under the eyes uh, it just uh, blends better when you let it sit for a couple of seconds and then I'm gonna take this uh, concealer buffing brush by PAC it's the PAC 219 brush um, if you are looking for good uh, concealer brushes um, then you should definitely try this one out it's it's amazing i've been using this for quite some time now and um, it, it just blends out everything very 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 seamlessly and very beautifully um, you'll see that in a minute so what i'm going to do is i'll start blending out the rest of my face and then at the very end i'm going to go in under the eyes so that's about it i'm not gonna go in with another layer of concealer but it's, uh, uh, it's totally up to you if you want to do that you can um but overall i really like how it's looking so natural and that is the look that i go for nowadays so the next product i'm already holding in my hand it is a compact powder i don't have a loose powder nowadays i just like to you know carry a compact powder wherever i go and uh, whatever i've applied i just like to use this to set my under eyes especially my under eyes so that it doesn't crease and this is from the night uh, from nika it is their all day matte compact powder in the shade beige 03 i will leave all the links down in the description box below and uh, all the prices will be up here on the screen and this is how it looks like it matches my sh uh, skin tone perfectly uh, it's not light it's not dark it's just that perfect uh, shade that gives me a little bit of coverage and helps set the under eye also this is very very inexpensive so if you are looking for a good compact powder uh, then you can definitely try this one out 
um, so far I've liked it I've used it a lot of times and I don't have any complaints uh, or anything negative to talk about this I got a lot of lipsticks this time from uh, from this particular haul and I'm thinking of doing a separate video on those lipsticks because it's impossible to show all of them uh, in this one video as you can see I have a lot of mm, lipsticks to show you uh, so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna just use one in today's video and for the rest I'm gonna do a separate video where you can see like proper swatches and reviews of each and every lipstick what I want to do now is I want to talk about the blushes okay today I have three different blushes to show you the first one is uh, again a very very popular uh, product which is currently uh, being raved by a lot of people it is the k-beauty uh, creme blush uh, this is in the shade flirty nude beautiful beautiful blush it's definitely a little bit overpriced I feel let me give you a quick swatch it's for $7.99 but then again this is gonna last you the tube is very small definitely it's literally the size of my finger as you can see but um, I think this is gonna last you a very long time and right now I just I'm just loving cream blushes and this is the shade it's a beautiful corally shade and as you can see um, it is pigmented but it's very very blendable like it's just flawless it blends out into this beautiful glowy glow from within kind of a blush oh, i just love it um and then the next blush i have is actually a duo it's from elf it's so cute i mean just look at that so oops it's a bite-sized duo product basically it comes with a blush and a highlighter and this is in the variant or shade spiced apple now i have to say the uh, blush is a little bit too dark for my skin tone so if you're somewhere a little bit more darker than my skin tone or towards the darker side of of the complexion or skin tones then this will look really really beautiful on you however the highlighter is beautiful it's stunning this is gonna look good on like all sorts of skin skin types as you can see it's just beautiful um so yeah this was also very very inexpensive it's 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 the size is just so cute and very very travel friendly you can literally slide it in your pocket your purse your bag it, it's gonna fit you anywhere also the pigmentation is really nice maybe i will uh, swatch the blush for you in a separate video and then the last blush i have is by swiss beauty this is how it looks like this is the carton that it comes in and uh, this is how the packaging looks like the actual blush as you can see it's just so sleek and like beautiful like the finishing packaging is beautiful if you could see yep and it's a beautiful shade i think i'm going to use this and this together um this is in the shade soft nude very very beautiful it's it's completely matte it doesn't have any sort of shimmer or you know chunky glitters or anything it's completely matte and it just looks looks very very beautiful so what i'm gonna do now is i'll probably go ahead and use this a little bit um you know spread it out a little bit and then go on whatever is left on my uh finger i like to use it with my finger sort of just blend it with my finger you can definitely use a blush it's completely your choice but uh, it just blends beautifully with the finger um, what I'm gonna do now is I'll take a blush uh, brush blush brush pick up some of that and just enhance it a little bit as you can see it's just such a beautiful color they also have like different um, options like a lot many colors which i'm planning to try very very soon um so yeah you can definitely choose whatever color but this color as you can see it's so beautiful for that indian skin tone okay i think i'm done <laughs> i don't want to overdo it and then what i like to do is because that's a cream product and usually cream products tend to move around very quickly and they disappear very quickly um i like to take a uh, powder blush 
so i'll take this one i'll take a fluffy brush fluffy uh, blush brush and take a little bit of it not much and this one is very very pigmented so you gotta be careful as you can see it's very pigmented and i'm gonna just apply it on top of that cream blush so basically it works like a setting powder for the blush it just sets the cream product in place i think i'm done so those were the blushes uh, what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna take this um, elf duo bite size palette and take the highlighter shade and just use that apply it here do you see that's such a beautiful highlighter i think it's very very pigmented it gives you that bling um, and yeah i absolutely love it a little bit here and on the tip of my nose all right i'm done so as you can see the blush and highlighter looks bomb i think i love this um let's move on to the next product okay i want to show you this eyebrow product that i got it is again from nika um this is the Nika Oh My Brow Eyebrow Mascara and uh, this is in the shade Serious Brown. So this is in the shade Serious Brown and uh, it looks something like this. Again, very, very cute and tiny packaging. I love it. Very, very travel friendly and that's how the um, brush looks like. So let's try this one out. I have very thin eyebrows so like I'm I'm never sure of my you know what am I supposed to do with my eyebrows it's, it's just very difficult to do them I just like to keep it very natural that's why so this is the kind of product which I feel uh, will work if you have very bushy thick eyebrows and you just want to like just set them in place or maybe kind of give that illusion of of a bushy eyebrow so i think this is um gonna work for those kind of eyebrows i think i'm done um i like to keep my eyebrows very very natural um you know it from my other um videos as well i don't like to overdraw them or you know make them look very thick or anything uh, so that is um, it. I have one or two more products and of course like the lipstick to show you. I have a mascara which I'm going to show you in a while but before that I want to do my eyes. Uh, I don't have anything for my eye eyeshadow like I don't like to um, get a lot of eyeshadows because I already have a lot of them so you know I just want to use them. I'm going to use this palette today sorry the, <laughs> the thing is broken but just ignore that and what I'm going to do is I'll just pick up this beautiful green shimmery shade and apply it all over my lids just to sort of match with my top. Uh, I'm just going to use my fingers for it and uh, then I'm going to use uh, this eyeliner by Lacme. I'm sure you already know about this. A lot of you probably already use it. Uh, again, uh, it, the glue is from my top. So I think that's going to look good. So I'll take that uh, green shimmery shade. That's how it looks like. Uh, let's see if it shows up or not. Yeah, it's very, very light. However, I like it. I don't want to overdo it. Uh, okay so i'm gonna go and uh, do my eyeliner like i showed you i'm gonna use this one and i'll come back all right uh so i'm back i'm done with the eyes um i think it looks really nice with the top that i'm wearing um i did that glittery eyeshadow and uh, the blue eyeliner so the last thing the last makeup product that i would like to show you i mean the second last the lipstick i keep forgetting is a uh, new mascara that i'm trying today it's by maybelline it is the lash sensational waterproof mascara i'm sure a lot of you have already tried this one out and let me just tell you i am loving this mascara just look at the wand it's like so thin and sleek i like to keep it like just one or two coats because um it just lengthens my eyelashes and makes it look beautiful you see the difference 
so yeah this is a beautiful um, mascara and uh, although it says waterproof uh, the thing with mascara is that i don't like to use waterproof mascaras because it's so difficult to get rid of um i always end up losing like 10 lashes but with this one somehow it's very very easy to remove and it just comes off very nicely you don't have to pull and tug on your eyelashes it just comes off very very nicely all right uh so the eyes are done the face is done the only thing that i'm left with are my lips and i'm very excited to show you this um what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna line my lips with this my glam uh, matte lip liner um this is in the shade spoiled and let me give you a quick swatch that's how the color looks like it's a beautiful nudie pink color and i'm gonna go ahead and put this on my lips just sort of line it oh, it's a beautiful color now i'm gonna go ahead with uh, one of the lipsticks and i'm gonna show you this one by uh, nika and this is in the shade flirty face so basically i think it's like a matte gloss um it is matte but also have like a very beautiful glossy finish uh, let me give you a swatch i'm not sure if it's gonna look good or not but we'll see I think it's a beautiful beautiful combination uh, it's that beautiful peachy nude color the lip liner and then this one is that beautiful you know nude just the right perfect nude for every skin tone and I love the formula of this lipstick it it definitely doesn't stay the entire day if you're gonna eat or you know drink something it is gonna come off but it feels very very light on the lips um, doesn't feel dry at all like in no way so yeah that is it for uh, the entire haul and that entire look i hope you enjoyed watching it and oh before i go there's another product to show you this is not a makeup item but um, a perfume um, this is by plum um, yeah plum uh, body loving ud perfume uh, in the sh in the flavor tripping mimosas and this comes in this beautiful sliding carton box and uh, the perfume is inside which looks something like this and oh my god you have to try this out guys it's just such a beautiful perfume wow i love it 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 just it's very fruity very florally it's more fruity not florally and i suck at describing perfumes by the way but it's very fruity and it stays on lingers on throughout the day and um, you don't even have to go ahead and apply a retouch or anything and it's just a beautiful beautiful perfume so definitely give this one a shot this is very very inexpensive i got this for 295 rupees so yeah it's, it's just beautiful you have to try this particular range of plum the body loving range anyway guys i hope you enjoyed watching this video and um, this is the final look um let me know what you think uh if you've already tried any of these products or you want to try just comment down below and uh, i'll see you soon very very soon in my next video and um, the next video probably is going to be another haul or maybe that lipstick video that i was talking about so i'm going to probably show you all the lipsticks that i have and uh, if there's anything else you'd like to see just comment down below and uh, let me know what you want to see um, i'll be you know looking forward to that so yeah see you again uh, next in my next video till then um stay safe be happy and uh, yeah see you soon bye